everyone. I'm Jamie Atkins with Health Team Advantage. Thank you so much for joining us for our Facebook Friday. Today we're going to do a DIY craft. It's going to be a really easy, I promise, just a few step craft. And if you're like me and get very intimidated by crafts, this is definitely going to want, be one that you want to try at home. It is actually a garden marker. So you know when you have all those great fruits or vegetables, or maybe you're doing an herb garden, and you have, it's hard to find the little, uh, tiny little plastic, you know, plant markers that come out. Sometimes they get washed away by the rain. This is going to be a really fun one. It's going to add some color to your garden and it's just fun to do. So what I have here, I got these three wooden spoons for less than a dollar. You can choose whichever size you would like. We're going to paint the top of it and then we're just going to take a Sharpie and write on there what we would like it to be. So if this is your squash, your thyme, maybe it's tomatoes, carrots, whatever you're doing. So I'll go ahead and show you. So that's all you need. You need a wooden spoon. I have some paint brushes, some paint, and my Sharpie marker. I also have um, some clear spray. If you're worried about them running a little bit in the rain, you can spray on a little clear spray at the end. So here is what it's gonna look like finished. I chose to do the orange for carrots here and use my Sharpie. You can add a little drawing if you'd like there on the top. And it's usually, I found it's much easier to use the Sharpie than try to go ahead and use the paint to put um, what it is on there because unless you have a really fine paintbrush. So we are going to do time. So I'm gonna take my wood spoon first I have my green paint here. I'm just gonna paint it all on. It's nice and easy. You can choose any color. Maybe you wanna add some red to your garden. You can have it match the actual plant color or choose another fun color that you wanna add. And maybe you just have a pot of herbs growing and that's your garden or maybe you have a large garden. These can be reused every year, which is really nice. And I promise all your neighbors will be asking you soon, how did you do those? You can see we have a nice fresh coat of our green paint on our spoon now. Make sure you get all the spots here. And there you go. We've already painted it green in probably about 30 seconds. You're just going to set it to the side, let it dry completely because if it's not all the way dry, your Sharpie marker may not write on it very well. And then you take your Sharpie marker And you can see that this one is going to be squash. So I'm just gonna write down the side of it here. And you might need to go over it a few times. And there you have it, a fun garden marker for your vegetables, plants, herbs, spices. I wanted to show you how useful and practical our DIY craft can be today. So we have a small raised bed garden. You can tell as squash and zucchini gets very large, it's hard to even see what's there. You can take your garden marker and stick it right in the front. That way you'll know always is that squash or is that zucchini, you'll know exactly what it is. Thank you so much for joining everyone. Make sure you tune in next week for our Facebook Friday. Have a great weekend.